Hey girl, hey, and welcome to my own damn show. My name is Emily, but you can call me Ems. Today I am here to review the Dea Cheesy Mac um, Deluxe Cheddar Style. Uh, what is it? Deluxe White Cheddar Style Veggie. So I've already done one video on this before. This is part two of the three part series of all the Dea Cheesy Mac flavors. And this one today is the Deluxe White Cheddar Style Veggie. So it's got vegetables in it, apparently. So this is gluten and soy free, dairy and lactose free, because it is vegan. And it has six grams of protein per serving. And one again, one serving is one third of the resulting mac and cheese. So last one had only five grams. This one has six grams of protein. And this one has nine grams of fat as well. So Still a bit of a fatty product, but again, it's a once in a while treat. You're not gonna have it all the time. It's just, you know, something fun if you're feeling a little nostalgic for the old craft dinner. This one is really different though. It is white cheddar, but it's got vegetables in it. And this is what it's supposed to look like. When it's done, hide myself. That's what it's supposed to look like when it's done up there. Isn't that cool? Back to me. So this is the macaroni as it comes. It has dehydrated peas, dehydrated carrots, dehydrated red pepper, and I think it's got some dehydrated onion as well. And then we've got our Gaia cheese sauce. So I'm going to cook this uh, in boiling water for seven to eight minutes, drain it, then add my cheese sauce, and I'll be back with you for the taste test. And we're back. I have finished cooking it, and this is what it looks like. Boop. It's got all the veggies in it, and it's got delicious, delicious macaroni, and it smells quite cheesy as well. So, let's go for it. say not as good as the original like orange cheddar still very cheesy a lit like the vegetables are kind of a nice touch it's a little something extra they don't really add much flavor or anything since they were you know freeze-dried but yeah not bad but because of the price I'd say out of these two that I've tried so far, go for the cheddar or the basic cheddar, but I haven't tried the Alfredo style yet, so who knows what that's going to bring. But thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you have a great day.